Dear students, today I am going to discuss question number 19 from rest and motion kinematics. This is a question based on the reaction time. You know what is reaction time? It is defined in the question a driver takes 0 0.2 second to apply the brakes after he sees a need for it. This is called reaction time. So, this is only one problem in SC Burma. You should remember it. It is very, very good concept. First of all, let us see. Object is moving with uniform speed. Object is moving with uniform speed. That is, u is equal to fifty-four kph, which can be converted fifty-four into five upon eighteen. Eighteen threes are fifty-four. That will be fifteen meters per second. This is the initial speed here. Now, time taken, let time is T1, which is equal to 0 0.2 second. You know, speed is uniform, therefore, acceleration will be 0. The simply distance S1 can be calculated, that is U into T. What is U? Let us see, that is 15, and time is 0 0.2. Finally, you will get only 3 meters. 3 meter is the initial displacement covered by the car when brake is applied. Now, in order to calculate the distance, total distance, you need to solve the question by some different manner. That is, S1 is 3 meters. Now, finally, it comes to rest. Finally, because it is retarded, comes to rest. Therefore, final velocity is taken 0. Final velocity is 0 and acceleration, which is called retardation, that is minus 6 meters per second square. And using v square minus u square is equal to 2a s. v is 0, u is given. What is u? Let us see that is 15. Square of 15 is there. Is equal to 2. Acceleration is minus 6 into I can write it as 2. This suppose that as 2. Now, S2 is 225, square of 15 is 225 divided by 12. That will be 18.75 approximately. Now, total distance covered is S1 plus S2. That will be 18.75 plus 3 meters, which is equal to 21.75 meters and it can be written as 22 meters. This is the answer. In this question, how to solve the question of question based on the reaction time? You should try to understand this. Thank you very much.